this is Mr. Karoff, and this is a video on how to update Zoom for Linux. Uh, if you are a Zoom user on Zubuntu, which many of our students are, you may have seen recently that your system will tell you that an update is available. The trick is, is that the Zoom client for Linux will not automatically update. It does require you to download the new version and install it. But there are a couple of tricks to that because simply using the default program to do it will not recognize that a new version has been downloaded. Here's how to get around that. If you see this, click the update now and it will bring you to the download page. I'm actually, now that I'm on the download page, I'm going to exit out of my Zoom. So, exit, because I don't want that getting in the way anymore. But I'm now in the download center, Zoom client for Linux. For Linux type, you click in this box, select Ubuntu. Zubuntu is a variant of Ubuntu, so it works the same on both systems. Click the button that says Download. And it starts to go into your download folder. Do not click where it says click to install Zoom. The reason why will be made apparent in just a moment. Depending on your download speed, this can either go fast or slow. This one's going reasonably fast. Just a little bit more. And we've got the whole thing. Now it'll say, this type of file can harm your computer. Do you want to keep it anyway? Click where it says keep. And here is where you're going to do something different. Do, again, do not click where it says click to install Zoom. Instead, you're going to go up to the mouse and click there. And we're going to use an alternate program to install it. We're going to use a program called GDebbie, which has been installed for you prior to you receiving the computer. And that is spelled G-D-E-B-I. And you'll see that it comes up right at the top as soon as you type in just a few letters, the GW package installer. So click on that. Then when that program fires up, you click File, click Open, and then go to your Downloads folder where you'll see the Zoom Debian file that you just downloaded. And then you click open down in the bottom of the corner there. Let's see, click open. And then it will start to, to load up that install file. Click the button that says install package. It'll ask you for your password. Use the password you were given when you got the computer. Click the button that says authenticate. And then the package installer will start to install the program. If you wish to see exactly what it's doing under the hood, you can click on the word terminal and a small terminal window will open up and you can actually see that it is in fact installing a brand new version of the program in favor of the old one. That just takes a moment or two to run. Yep, it's finishing out the last few processes that it needs to go through to, uh, to install the new version over the old version.
and now it says that it was installed so I can now close this window and it will show me that it's done. Now when I close GDB and I go to launch Zoom and if I take a look here at check for updates it will show me that I am now up to date. And this is how you do it. Download, exit out of Zoom, install with GDB, and then you're up to date. If you have any questions, please email us at the Penguin Corps or at Aspen Academy. Have a good day. Bye.